So I, I truly believe that every actor, when they do a performance, invests some of themselves in the performance. You know, there's some, you carry qualities that, and then for me, I just highlighted them. So Kruger, for me, I cared for these five, you know. I, I loved them, hard love. When he found out his wife was alive, uh, I felt that the character arc changed because then he didn't have to carry that guilt that he let his wife be killed and she was alive. So I tried to make him more human near the end, more relatable. So if you look at the series, he, Doggy Kruger would actually crack, crack a few jokes, you know? He had humor. He was more lightened. I'll share a story. We had a shot, so after, we had a shot where they were filming Doggy Kruger and he would talk about the origins of his planet and how they all got wiped out and how he felt he failed to protect the woman he loved, you know? Like in Braveheart, he couldn't protect her no matter what he did. But the vengeance after that was harsh. The man was hardened by that experience. Um, when they flipped it around, I came out of the dog's head and I told the story again. Because when I was in the dog's head, I felt I gave a performance for me that was worthy. It was one of my best performances. I was crying in that moment, and I'm in the dog's head. And no one will ever see it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's like doing theater. You, 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 you do a great performance, the audience applauds, but it was never recorded. It's gone forever. And one of my best performances was in that dog's head, telling these cadets how I loved them, and I will never let them down, but they need to just trust me and my process, and I will protect them, and they're going to be great power rangers. I was crying when I talked about my wife in a dog's head. It was emotional. Um, that was probably one of my best performances. You know what I mean? Yeah. I, I emptied the tank, man. I emptied the cup. I pour my soul into every character I play because I want it to be real. I leave a bit of myself in it. Borderline schizophrenia sometimes, but at the same time, you have to know that it's just fun. Mm -hmm. I love being part of this fantasy world. Once a ranger. Oh, always a ranger. ranger. <laughs> Every time.